Hi. Now for this last part, we're being asked to state a possible value for A and a possible value for B in these two equations. Now remember, we didn't know which graph related to each equation. But when we found out where they intersect the y-axis, we can see that y equals a to the power x intersected at naught 1 from the very first question. So this has got to be the graph of y equals a to the power x. Let's just put it in there, y equals a to the power x. And we know that this graph crossed at naught 4. So this must be the graph then of y equals 4 b to the power x. Now, that determines the range of values for A and the range of values for B now. Let's start with A. A graph like this is given when A is any value greater than 1. So as long as you give any value greater than 1, doesn't matter what you give, A equals 3, 4, 4.6 maybe, any value greater than 1, that's going to be fine. Now as for B, for a curve like this, which is decreasing, then we know that B must lie between 0 and 1. So any value that you want to give between 0 and 1 would be acceptable. Okay.